An exciting time of the year for the Big 12 champion West Virginia Mountaineers as they take their show on the road to the Big 12 tournament in Oklahoma City. Alongside former Mountaineer great Meg Bulger, I'm Jeff Colhane and Meg, here we are in Oklahoma City, the Big 12 tournament and WVU, the two seed in this tournament. An exciting time of year, no question about it, and a great opportunity for this team to play in a great arena. Absolutely. I mean, this environment's great. Oklahoma City's been wonderful, um, but it's a new season. You know, yeah. winning the conference championship, that's also, you know, that's tremendous, but this is a new season, and they have something else on their checklist, and that's a Big 12 championship. Let's lay out the tournament quick. The first game on Friday night is the 8-9 matchup, Kansas taking on Kansas State. The second game, which we'll be watching intently, is the 7-10 matchup, TCU taking on Texas Tech. Texas Tech has not won a game in conference play. TCU, a very scary opponent to think about, Meg, in this situation, this setting, they gave West Virginia a lot of fits the two times the Mountaineers played them this season. They sure did, and it's difficult to beat a team three times. As a lot of players know, uh, Zana Medley makes them go. She runs the show. They're a very feisty, scrappy bunch defensively, and, and it's almost an advantage playing the first night. You get your momentum going. You're used to the gym. You're used to the rims, so West Virginia's going to have to come out ready. Second day of the tournament, the 4-5 matchup, Iowa State taking on Oklahoma State. The 3-6 match, matchup, an interesting one, Texas and Oklahoma going head-to-head. -head. Of course, Baylor, they are in the one seed with a tiebreaker in the Big 12 Conference. The Big 12 Conference announced their all-conference teams on Thursday, and West Virginia very well represented. Asia Bussey, Bria Holmes, both named first-team selections. Asia and Jess Harley named to the all-defensive team, and Taylor Palmer, the sixth man of the year in the Big 12 Conference. WVU very well, well, well represented on that all-Big 12 squad. And, and as they should be. They've earned it. They played as a team all year. That's, you know, what got them there. But these individual awards are nice because these girls have earned it. They deserve it, and I'm really, really happy for them and proud of them. They and, deserve it. And last but not least, Mike Carey named the Big 12 Coach of the Year. An outstanding season. You know, he, he jokes about it. I don't care about that stuff but more than deserving for coach as this group has had a great year. It is, and that's just a testament to the program and the type of program that he's creating here at West Virginia. And, hey, second year in the Big 12, you're getting coach of the year. That says a lot. That's our Big 12 tournament report here from Chesapeake Energy Arena in Oklahoma City. West Virginia, the two seed, they play the first night game on Saturday. Our pregame show begins at 645 Eastern, tip-off at 7 o'clock. Listen to us on the Mountaineer Sports Network from IMG. For WVUSports.com, also for Meg Bulger, I'm Jeff Colhane here in Oklahoma City.